Good afternoon, everybody. Will Dupree here in the KXAN live studio. We've got some potential economic development news to share about Central Texas here. This is from our reporting partner at the Austin Business Journal. They put out a big story this afternoon saying that Amazon, the e-commerce giant, may be building another large distribution center here in Central Texas. According to their reporting, they have a source that told them that this new facility is going to be built in Pflugerville. And they even have a rendering of what it might look like, too. Take a look. This is the rendering that the Austin Business Journal is sharing about this new Amazon facility. It is going to be, according to the plans that are in the works right now, a massive 3.8 million square foot facility in Pflugerville. Now this one, according to the Austin Business Journal's reporting, is four times larger than the Amazon facility that's currently in San Marcos. That one is about 800,000 square feet, and this one, the one in Pflugerville that's going to be coming there potentially is 3.8 million, almost 4 million square feet there in Central Texas. We also have a map that the Austin Business Journal shared with us. Take a look at this. This is where this facility potentially will go according to the plans. We'll take it full screen so you all can see a little bit closer there. This is on the west side of the 130 tollway there in Pflugerville. It's on Pecan Street. According to the reporting that we have now, this is going to be on about 94 acres at 2000 East Pecan Street. That's less than a mile from State Highway 130 in Pflugerville and Travis County. According to the city, this project has long been kind of uh, it's gone by a misnomer for the city. They, they've called it Project Charm in a lot of their documents, so they're not exactly naming Amazon as the deal here. But a source has told the Austin Business Journal that this project is indeed that large tech company, Amazon, building a new uh, dis potential distribution center here in Central Texas. Now, Pflugerville, going back a little bit on this project, Pflugerville annexed the property on November 26th. The Pflugerville Planning and Zoning Commission on December 2nd, so earlier this month, recommended rezoning the site as a planned unit development. And now the rezoning is set to go before the Pflugerville City Council for consideration on January 14th. So coming up in about less than a month, the Pflugerville City Council is going to talk about rezoning this particular property that you see right here. Again, it's on the west side of State Highway 130 on Pecan Street. This is about 94 acres that is planned on this facility. And if you want to take a look one more time, this is what this facility potentially is going to look like. Four and a half stories. It's going to be a logistics distribution center for Amazon. And it's about 3.8 million square feet. Now, we are live right now on Facebook and KXAN.com and the KXAN News app. So if you have any questions about this particular facility or any comments, leave that on Facebook. We'll try to address some of those here in just a minute. But again, this project has been called Project Charm in some of the city documents and the other discussions that have happening because the city has not exactly said that this project is dealing with Amazon. Now, we did reach out to some of the city agencies, and I want to pull up this one comment that we got today from the Pflugerville Community Development Corporation. Its executive director, Amy Madison, released a statement, and she said, quote, we are still under consideration by Project Charm and due to a non-disclosure agreement are unable to disclose the name of the company. So they're still being cryptic there. That statement went on to say, we have pursued this project in earnest due to, it, due to its potential impact on capital investment and job creation for Pflugerville. So, you know, they are, there's a lot of hope here that this is going to bring a pretty big job creation, a boost to the local economy, but they are not specifying that it is Amazon. Now, the Austin Business Journal says it has a source confirming that that is what the company is. And as you see right here on the side of my screen here and what you're looking at, this is what that facility could look like in Pflugerville. So what do you all think? You all are sounding off on Facebook right now, so I was going to look at the, at the comments for just a moment. If you wanted to watch that for 
<laughs> Someone is saying, uh, good, keep it up north. <laughs> uh, there's a lot of traffic up there in that way because I live in that direction and cover that area a lot, so I've dealt with a lot of traffic in that area again. But this facility would go on Pecan Street just west of State Highway 130 if all the plans work out and it uh, goes, to, goes to the vote for the City Council. Re rezoning vote will again happen on January 14th, so coming up next month. We'll be sure to follow that along. But I wanted to show you all quickly what this article is on our website. So if you wanted to read a little bit more about it, go into detail, we can pull that up really quickly. Here's the story right here, headline on our website, Amazon preparing to build massive distribution center outside Austin. And it goes into the reporting that the Austin Business Journal, our reporting partner here at KXAN, has shared today a big economic story potentially coming to Central Texas. You can read the full article on the Austin Business Journal's website. We do have a bit of their reporting on ours. And I want to point out this one statement. Not only is the Pflugerville Community Development Corporation not saying this is specifically Amazon, Amazon also released a statement to the Austin Business Journal. I'm highlighting it right here. Amazon said in a statement to the ABJ, it does not comment on, quote, speculation. So it's a bit of mystery, a bit of intrigue about what this project might be, but sources are telling a lot of people at the Austin Business Journal that this is indeed Amazon coming to Pflugerville and another facility here in Central Texas. If it's built, if it comes to Pflugerville, it would be um, four times larger than the Amazon facility in San Marcos where it has a warehouse at the moment. So thank you all for joining us here in our live stream. Again, you can find out more reporting about this on our website, kxan.com and the KXAN News app. We'll see you there and provide some more details and we'll follow along this story as more information becomes available and potential action on these items comes up for vote in Pflugerville. Thanks again for joining us. Have a great Friday, everybody.